50p a week is quite enough, Henry. I'm very happy with my pocket money. I always save loads. You could learn a lot from Peter, Henry. Ah! Don't be horrid, Henry. That's enough, Henry. No pocket money for a week. What? No! I need a new castle! You'll have to save up then, won't you? But, but how can I save money if you're not giving me any? You could earn it. <laughs> earn it? Oh, get off, Henry! Broken. Burst. A chess set? What were they thinking? I need more things! Hmm, you look lonely. Come with Henry! like a baby's bum! Ooh, you got any food? No. How much have you made so far? 37p. You're wasting the smell! Hitting a sale, Henry. Nothing gets past you, does it, Al? All money raised goes to a very good cause. Child in need. Henry, that's Mum's special perfume! Oh, she's got loads of bottles. She'll never miss one. That's ten pounds. Hmm. I'll give you one. Done. That's Dad's tennis racket. Oh, stop moaning or I'll sell you. Oranges. Buy my juicy oranges. Oh, give me five groats for this weedy peasant. He'll scrub floors, clean out your pigs and he only eats mud. You break him. That's it. Would you like to earn some money, Peter? How? I could sell you as a servant, and I'll give you 10p. Is that all? All right. 10p a day. That'd be 20p for the weekend. Hmm, I suppose it would help my savings plan. All right, I'll do it. Please don't let Rebecca babysit. She's horrible. She's not horrible, just strict. That's it! No! Oh, don't answer it, Worm! I bet she eats elephants for breakfast. What have you got to eat? Um, help yourself to anything in the fridge. Um, bedtime is nine o'clock, and uh, remember, Henry, don't be horrid! So you're the one known as Ori's Henry. And you're the one known as Rabid Rebecca. And I'm the one known as Perfect Peter. And I know we're all going to have a good time. Good's good. I like good. I expect good. I demand good. Are we clear? Uh, uh, that's lucky. I'm really good at being good. But it'll be difficult for you. Yeah, this is going to be tough. Take back, you miserable, maladjusted, malicious, malevolent mutant! Hey! I was watching Mutant Max! Would you care for some refreshments? <sighs> popcorn! I hate popcorn! Oh, uh, sorry, my mistake. I should have checked first. Oh, I love ballroom dancing. What's your favourite? The foxtrot? The, the tango? Get lost. Shut up! Henry, you're doing it all wrong. It's more of a cha 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 than a do 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 da. Get out of my way! You can both go to bed right now. But it's not my bedtime for hours. I thought we could all have a nice game of Chinese checkers before bedtime. Oh, OK. If you don't like that, how about Tiddlywinks? We're playing hide and seek. 
You both hide, and if I find you, you'll be wishing I hadn't. Torch, scissors, notepad and pen? Check. Boot polish, lucky rotten duck egg, and fake dog poo. Check. I'm going to get you back, Mr. Kill. And then I'll get whoever took you. Detective Henry always gets his man. This smells like an inside job. Dodgy Dad. But why? Henry! Henry! Ta-da! Henry! Oh! oh, you really are horrid, Henry! Yeah, Dad. You can run, but you can't hide. 4.35 p.m. Suspect cooking healthy food in kitchen. <gasps> no! Don't cook Mr. Kill! Uh, what? You took Mr. Kill while I was at school! And now you want us to eat him! Don't be horrid, Henry. Look, it's a chicken. Oh. And I was at work when you were at school. Oh. Suspect has alibi. Maybe Mr. Kill left home. You're always throwing him around and stamping on him. Mr. Kill would never leave me! Well then, look in your fort. Maybe you left him there. No! I didn't leave him. He was stolen. Mr. Kill, where are you? I'm in charge because it's my garden. Oh, but you're always in charge in my garden too. Well, somebody has to be in charge around here. Oh, yeah. Now there's someone who has a motive. Moody Margaret. She's always wanted to get me back. Is she going to be all right? She'll pull through. What are you doing? Revenge and ransom. Two perfect motives. Moody Margaret kidnapped Mr. Kill. Oh! Henry? Henry! <laughs> Henry! Henry! <laughs> Go away, worm! You're spoiling everything! But it's my turn! Mum said you've got to share! Mum said! Mum said! <laughs> I told you to share the box with Peter. And don't forget, Miss Lovely will be here soon to talk about the school play costumes. Miss Lovely? Oh, goody. Let's make the box into a little cottage just for her. Now, I'm just popping next door for a minute. So, Henry, behave. Oh, we could um, cut out windows here, paint flowers and... No! Don't you touch my box. It's a time machine, you toad! It is not! It's made of cardboard and a new washing machine came in it! If it looked like a time machine, everyone would try and steal it! Don't you know anything? It's in disguise! No! It's top secret! Well, if it is a time machine, then I want to have a go! You can't! You're too young! I'm not! And I don't believe you anyway. Then watch this. I'll prove it's a time machine by travelling to the future. Stand back. You don't want to get scorched by the Vortex Blast. I don't believe you're going to the future. Whoa! The Vortex! Ah! Into the future! 
Henry? Have you really gone? Wow! It really is a time machine! <laughs> what if he is stuck in the future? What if he never comes back? I could watch whatever I want on TV! I wanna go! I wanna go far! I wanna go! Horrid Henry, you are charged with being willfully and horribly horrid. Does Henry deserve to go to the fair? No! Henry melted my crayons on the radiator! Henry set off the fire alarm! Henry was sick on my carpet! Henry called me pretty! <gasps> pretty ugly! <gasps> Enough, Henry! I sentence you to never, ever go to the fair! No! Are we good? Are we good? You freaker! That's it! Are we good? Because good children get to go to the fair! Out of my way, worm! I'm taking Mum and Dad their juice. But I always take them their juice. Too late, slow coach. Oh, you haven't put something horrible in here, have you, Henry? No. Open the door. Oh, I can take it in for you. No, let go! <laughs> oh, don't be horrid, Henry. Go and get something to clear up this mess. Can I come with you, Dad? I love going to the supermarket. Of course you can, Peter. Out, Henry! That's not fair! You're taking Peter! Why can't I come? Because I remember the last time you came shopping. I'll be good, I promise. I just want to help. Please? Cucumber, tomatoes, salad. Dad said I could push the trolley. You did it last time. Dad! Henry's being mean! Don't be horrid, Henry. It's okay. Peter can push. I don't care what... What did you say? Peter can push the trolley. I don't mind. Are you feeling OK, Henry? Fine, thank you. Um, well... Well done. Well done, then. Being good is really hard work. Hmm, I don't know. How about leek and broccoli? Um, yes, but Mum likes spicy parsnip. Fine. Henry... We need baked beans. I know where they are, Dad. It's OK. I'm on to it. Henry? It's late. Go to bed. But Bed. Fine. I'll run away tomorrow. this? Um, no. Why am I not surprised? Selfishness must be deplored. Goodness is its own reward. Best boys always pass the test. Best boys better than the rest. B-E-S-T. Best boys! Hi, Henry. Do you want to join our club and be a best boy? No way! How long has your stupid 
the meeting going to last? All day. We've got lots of gold stars to give out. I bet you have. <sighs> Suitcase. Okay. I'm running away. Tonight. Cool. Where to? Oh, you know, Africa, probably. Always wanted to visit Africa. You can come if you want. Nah, I miss Karate Killers on the Blood Channel. Wait here. Oh, a map would help too. Grizzly Grub Box. Dungeon Drink Kit. Goose Shooter. Mr. Kill. Day glow slime? Uh, what else? Ah, comics. Gotta have something to read when I'm not fighting lions. <laughs> Bedtime, Henry! Come on, into bed. What's all this? Um, Ralph lent me some comics. Hmm. Well, don't stay up all night reading. Good night. Go to bed early. But it was me who found out the password for Margaret's secret club. Yes, but you deserted your post when you were on guard duty. I didn't. Susan wanted a glass of water and I... Oh. Prepare for your official purple hand gang punishment. <laughs> A baby is only water. Oh no, Margaret. It's turbo powered water. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you have to be so horrid, Henry? But I didn't do anything much. And why can't you play nicely with Peter? Oh! <laughs> oh. oh. It. I don't care who started it. Play nicely or else. Oh, it's not fair. What's the matter with you? Are you in trouble? If I'm not good, they're going to get rid of my fort. Oh, no. Oh, yes. And plant more vegetables instead. Oh, that's really mean. Yeah, really mean. Cos <laughs> even vegetables wouldn't want to join your ratty gang. <laughs> Compared to my gang, your club is stinkier than a pooper scooper. Everyone knows the purple hand gang is best. You think so? Well, why don't you prove it? Are you challenging me? I dare you to challenge me. OK, I challenge you. The, the pre min the pre -mient. The best? The best! The secret club! Hooray! Or the purple hand gang! Hoorah! Let the battle commence! Revenge! Revenge! you make, the longer you'll stay in your room. But what if I need to go to the toilet? That's the only reason you can leave. Do you understand? It's not fair! <laughs> I get sent to my room a lot. I get sent to my room so often I might as well live here full time. Good thing there's lots to do.
taken all your things away because we want you to think about why you're being punished. Huh? And we'll have a talk about it later. What? They've even taken my CD player. I'm not gonna buy rat CDs. I can't live without my music. Hold on a minute. Ask your mother. Lock him in a cage for a hundred years. Hang him upside down and set his ears. Throw him in the river with the crocodiles. Shoot him into space for a million miles. Now I'm ready to wreak my revenge. Well, as soon as they let me out of my room. Uh oh. If they see this, I'll be stuck in here forever. Luckily, no one comes in here unless the music's too loud! <laughs> Henry, it's dark in here. <laughs> Henry, what are you doing? Those are dads. Oh, it's too dark to play golf. Follow me, worm. She wouldn't hear us. Fine. But they haven't built the prison that can hold me. Give me a leg up. What about me? Oh, they'll find you one of these days. Now give me a leg up. No, you might leave me here. Peter, what's this? 
I know. I know. Oh, clever you to remember it's wash day. Come on, Peter. You'll have to do better than that. Right. I'm absolutely going to be more horrid. After breakfast. Out of my way, worm! <sighs> Stupid weeds! You knew Great Aunt Greta was coming, didn't you? Henry? What are you doing? Um, I'm looking for slugs. Look, I've got loads already. Lovely, Henry. Well, just stay away from my flowers. Lies, Henry. It's true. I sprayed him. Well, Henry, you should have got out of the way when Peter was watering the flowers. What's the big idea? You're not the only one that can be horrid. <laughs> you call that horrid? Ha! Henry, you're filthy. I can't have Great Aunt Greta seeing you like that. Bath now. But now! It's only an injection. It's not like it's major surgery. Silence, worm! Don't be nervous, Henry. Ha! Nervous? Why would I be nervous? It's only an injection. That's right. It's just a few centimetres of needle jabbed into your flesh. <laughs> Out and... <laughs> Henry? Henry? <laughs> Henry, time for school. I can't go to school today, Mum. Wherever not. Well, I've got a cough. <clears throat> oh, come on, Henry. You'll have to do better than that. Um, uh, the school burnt down uh, yesterday. Oh, I didn't see any flames. Silence, worm. Don't be horrid, Henry. I can't go to school today because I I've broken my leg. Ow! Ow! Oh, the pain. Ooh. Poor Henry. I know it's injection day today, Henry, and you are going to school whether you like it or not. Now, let me see. B for broken leg. Just lie back and relax, Henry. I can help you. Yes, Peter. Yes, you can. <laughs> but I don't want to pretend to be you for the day. <clears throat> You'll get to play in the big boy's playground. Yes. Whoa! <clears throat> And you'll get to sit in the big boys' class. So? You'll get maths homework. <gasps> Ooh, goody! I love maths homework! Um, but if I'm you, won't I get your injection? Oh, yeah. Uh, I hadn't thought of that. But think of all that maths homework. This is never going to work. Of course it will. Henry? Peter? <sighs> You're right. It's never going to work. Ah! Ah! This injection.
protection. Better not leave a mark. My arms are beautiful and I want them to stay that way. You better hope she doesn't hit an artery. This causes massive blood loss, gangrene and possible amputation. That means they cut your arm off. <gasps> oh, please. It's only a pinprick. Yeah, only a pinprick. <laughs> now, Henry, can I still go to Ralph's today? Maybe. After you've done all your chores, we'll see. Yay! When parents say we'll see, they always mean yes. Ooh, I love doing my chores. Worm. Come on, Henry. The sooner you get started, the sooner you'll be finished. Oh, all right. What do I have to do? Well, you can start by cleaning out your hamster. <gasps> Uh, hello, Fang. Remember me? <sighs> Come on, Fang. Climb inside. <sighs> All right. Come on, little Fangy Fangy. Who's a pretty boy, then? Little Fangy, little Fangy, I love you, I love you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Henry, what are you doing? Nothing. is going on here? Fang's being horrid to Fluffy. That's not true. <coughs> Put Fang away now, Henry. You haven't got time to play with him. Oh, look at your room. It's even more of a mess than usual. Oh, you can tidy it later. Can you empty all the rubbish bins now, please? Oh, come on, Fang. Time to go back. <coughs> When I'm king, only parents will have to do chores. Quiet, smelly nappy baby! Some of us are trying to sleep! <laughs> <laughs>